Round one. Fight! <laughs> They are all talking about kids, and I'm like, am I not a real adult? And I know we always make the jokes about being man babies and stuff. I still think that I still think that so people angry about that. guys specifically I don't I don't really pretend to have any insight into the female brain at all. Not I don't even know if I want it to be perfect. But I feel like every guy has that thing. <laughs> no. Oh no, I just mean like I like to go home and I just like to watch I like to watch Netflix. I like to watch Arrow and Netflix, right? But when I go home You don't like watch to watch Netflix, you like to watch Netflix. Well, I like to play through Netflix and add things, Kirby's nuts and things to my Instagram, which my wife has not figured out how to take things off of my Instagram. Now it's fine. Now it's a war. I'm losing. She's got more time on her hands. She's close to the house. Um, no, I realized that I can do it online. It's not the same experience. It's not the same experience. It's not the same, <laughs> not the same experience. It's not the same experience. You're about to say, okay, you can go, then you can do it for you. Yeah, no, I don't use my phone. It's not the same thing. I what if that's what Nick was doing on his phone every time he was doing it? So it's not bar. Oh, it's Monster Squad, right? Really. <laughs> not bar on it. No, but I feel like when you're when you're a kid, you just get to like that's your world. The world's all the fun things and then you get to the You don't have a lot going on. When you're an adult, you have to balance your time and that is what adult means to me. It means when I go home, I'm gonna walk through the door and I'm gonna be like, cool, now I can just watch TV. No, it's time to pay your taxes. No. Also you said you go to the grocery store with me. No, and these are not things that I necessarily like or dislike. It's just you got it. When you were a kid, I think it was like everything was a little more hard now. When you were an adult, you have to deal with a little bit more than once, right? And when you get to like midnight, you're like, and sometimes yeah, I'm here that's super worse. tired, and I'm like, sometimes I fight it. I'm like, fuck it. I'm staying up at 3 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. Quite an adult yet. <laughs> very, very, to be fair, fair you enough. and Kevin are still uh, yeah. man children. Well, I mean, here's the thing I get the errands done. You are first round. Come to the end. Come on, man. Safeway. And it was a fucking golden age to be alive. Like nine bucks. And I just order online, everything shows up. I'm like dynamite. And then when I got, I got sick, I came to my little case of cancer. And Christine's like, we're eating organic. And it's not Safeway's fault. <laughs> Never played <laughs> Safeway. <laughs> Round one. Fight! <laughs>
Round two. Fight! Cut off all the expenditures for things we like. <laughs> uh, I'm only kidding. I'm probably gonna have kids one day, and it's gonna be a, just as miserable experience as everyone else. Although I will not fake it. I'm just gonna. Someone's gonna be like, "What is it like?" Lord being a knows. Call it Moriarty. Someone's gonna, like, oh, so, someone's gonna be like, "What is it like having kids?" And I'm like, <laughs> yeah. Um. But jokes aside, I think that we live in a very insulated, we live in a very insulated industry. I, I've talked to Cheryl about, you know, my girlfriend, about this where um, she, our connection to the people we grew up with on the island, a lot of them are married or divorced now. Uh, they have kids and stuff. And, and she often is the one that says, we, we, you live in a fantasy world specifically. It's not only you. <laughs> telling jokes but being ser more serious is that people really do derive pleasure out of having kids and having a family and stuff like that and by 30 31 32 33 it, the, the die is cast for a lot of people <laughs> Greg and I don't live together, and I can see a future where in 10 years, Greg and I indeed still live together, mm -hmm. it, when we're in our early 40s, and that to us is normal, because then we look around San Francisco, and it's like, everyone, it's expensive, no one lives by themselves unless they have like, you know, a rent-controlled apartment, and blah, 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 so I think that our gauge of adulthood is just, is way askew, and so our adulthood that everyone would have, yeah, paying bills sucks, Round one, fight! <laughs>
Kevin is his fucking bitch. I'm the the Olive Garden, Garden, no less. I can't um, believe that. <laughs> yes. We're not Please. going. We're not going to the Olive Garden tonight. I was not expecting. You don't fucking go to the Olive Garden. I read How it much on your of the eyes. business is she going to take? Oh, she only gets my percentages of it. That's it. Half of your she percentage. She only gets half no. of whatever I own. She gets it all. She gets everything. That's it. Power suit. We're like, oh, no, it happened. <laughs> uh, so I, I just think that the, the whole, you know, people really enjoy having Oh, yeah. People enjoy having having Settling down, buying a house, having a job and a career, having a nine to five, cutting it off then, working in the yard. Oh, fucking house. Do you, know, you know what I mean? Like these are normal everyday things. And I shook my head before when you were asking people who had read it. But yeah, we might. I don't think I'm we going might to. because just like, but this like, I was weird to be in the grocery store and not be like, I need to get home and get the trophy. It was just like, wait, a second. is this what everybody back in the middle of the country? No, they don't care about trophies. The the why that's what I mean. No, I, they, they, they don't that's, know the relief. And I'm not, and I'm not, and I'm not judging you at all. I'm telling you, and I'm right there with you. Uh, but it, it's the conundrum. It's the conundrum of the of the insurer and how we all grew up together. And we all kind of. I'm not saying us at the table. I'm not saying us at, as the old IGN crew, which you know Tim, you know, was a little late to but was still to be a very part of that crew. But the same mentality of we're all in this together, and it's all normal. Trust me, it's all totally perfectly normal. We hang out all the time together. We go to bars together. We see each other constantly. None of us are in committed relationships. So this is totally normal. And when you just go anywhere else, go to a wedding in another state, go to see your family, or something else, nothing else, nothing else. So, do I think that I'll, I'll, I'll have regret? Yeah, maybe. See, not, what, not, what are you going to regret? Because any time I hang out with any of my friends that aren't the people you just described, the conversation usually goes, Oh, man, I haven't seen you before. Oh, man, everything's fun. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh, this cool thing I did, and 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 this cool thing I did, and
if he likes it. Another fight is coming your way. Well, that's the, the thing with you, Colin. I know we're kind of a little off topic, but the the, the idea of you doing it your, when you're this is 50. Nick's first show. He didn't know he got off topic. No, I know, I know. But with the, the idea of you doing this. You are first left. Right. 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 You know, like you watch, uh, what does that show you? Mike and Mike or any of those shows, right? Those guys yeah, are right. still talking about sports. Sure. And they're not young anymore, no, they're right? Not, they're they not young. Be no, and that's a great point. But again, the reason why they're so. Round one. Fight. something but i don't know the, i think to, you do it all i think you, i think you can use this I'd as like a springboard to. i think that's the whole point or whatever lives their life however i've seen so many of my friends and just people i know do the exact opposite of normal a perfect example one of my friends finance major Decided to not take a job because he wanted to finish writing a script he has. Now he's got a movie coming out. Nice. Then, had he gone with the normal thing of like, nah, you know, the bank, go with it, like, he'd be fucking miserable. Yeah, he'd be really good at spreadsheets, though. He'd know he, Excel like yeah. nobody's It's just like that. It's like everyone tells you what's normal or what to do. Fuck that, do what you want to do. I mean, take care of yourself and all, but like, at the end of the day, if you're not happy with what you're doing. Great match.
Sponsors Loot Crate. For less than $20 a month, Loot Crate gives the geek and you a special treat every month. Loot Crate is a subscription box service with more than $40 worth of geek, gamer, and pop culture gear, collectibles, apparel, comics, etc. delivered your mailbox every month. This month they're bringing you a fight for the Suit up, choose your allies.
you damn fool. I you just you one, I gave you one literal <laughs> reference that it's happened and you didn't mention contrarian You crazy old fool. <laughs> you but you two need Who to spend some time. Who brought up contrarianism? Let's it. think about that. Thank you. Oh, this is video. fucking <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> just because you, you can infer something that's going to be literally talking about it. Shoes is it? I can just, I think it's 13. I've been hearing reading iPad. something about it recently because I remember hearing about it.
a very wow. old nostalgic memory of me being really sad about it. I think, I, yeah. I saw it. Kill my father. Now, let's begin! Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just join them. I'll just assume you join them. Yeah, sure. I'm they call them the bug ear. <laughs> what is it? Bugsy? Bugs? They just call me bugs? Bugs growing up. No one's calling me bugs. Invincible, Spider Man, Spider Gwen, uh, Spider Gwen, yeah. Batgirl, yeah. Batman, and uh. You are first rank. And now this this new stuff they got going on, I'm like, fuck yes. Yeah, it's I like great. It a lot. I like reboot question mark storyline a lot, but. Just came out. Yeah. So you're like, oh. Boom! That's how you start the fight and finish it quickly. Oh, Want to see my kung fu? I'll show you. Round one. Fight. Keep coming. Teddy, get out of the... 
Nice. <laughs> it was just like, what is <laughs> Private Eye was something someone recommended to me like months ago. Downloaded all of them. Um, it's like a really interesting, it's like a uh, pay. Which was pretty unique for comics. So this is what I'm trying to pitch Colin on, Private Eye. So the plot of Private Eye is we're in the the near future. So it's like 2000. <laughs> revealed to the world. So all of your search history, all of your, your contacts, all of your... Um, I think I've actually like, heard of this, yeah. Yeah, I, I told you about it. Round one. Fight! Yeah. Uh -huh.